<laughs> this is going to be interesting. I hope the camera doesn't get bounced off the base drum. It probably will. That's why I can't have anything nice. I break all my toys, eh? I was like that as a kid, and I haven't changed, and I'm 50. I don't know. Maybe there's hope for me. I don't know. Uh, just going to show you some of my hand techniques. Hopefully the camera angle will be good enough. Good enough. To be honest. From, from the camera angle, you can actually see everything because it's such a wide angle, but I'll just move that out of the way. So. I shouldn't, I shouldn't, but I'm going to... Okay. <laughs> you can see the camera. <laughs> I don't know what that was like for you guys on that side. It's like, earthquake! <laughs> there we go. God, that's got to be awfully loud. Uh, it's a cool place for it, though. Uh, the coolest camera view I've seen so far from a drummer is uh, the I Prevail guy. Uh, I forget what his uh, drum channel is. Huge drum drum channel but he's got just his big tom here he's got two floor toms here he's got an interesting setup he doesn't have any small toms he just has these two and he's sitting there he's just cranking in on it right and it looks like he's like death gripping like that which i know you're not supposed to do so i got my ticks these ticks 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 i got my uh <laughs> i shouldn't make fun of that uh i got my sticks uh that's my balance points Good. And, oh, where? Oh, you had to go under the guitars. You had to go under the guitar. Okay, so I'm gonna try the. So the French grip, I think, is what I'm more natural to. But there's two types of French grips. There's just the regular French. Grip. And then there's. The, what they call it? The saltier? Is that saltier? No. Marching band stuff. The German grip, a little more flattened out in 45. But I don't like moving my wrist like this because that's tendonitis waiting to happen. But this shouldn't be too bad. Get my fingers more engaged. sticks it changes a bit uh, if I do the molar thing the, the flam as they call it yeah uh, did you hear about only fans they got taken uh, taken out by a bunch of drummers uh, who started up uh, only flams I'm a musician not a comedian anyway uh, the heavier sticks the big boys Doing the same thing same thing got my balance points uh, I tend to be more thumbs up I notice that when you get on the balance point, not too bad, but once you start really, it doesn't do, do the job as much, but if you back up past the balance point and put more stick forward weight, you tend to bounce better. Thank you. 
Same thing with the uh, the lighter sticks, and they uh, back off the balance point. So get on the balance point. Nice and light, really quick. But when I back them out to go more weight forward. same bounce so these tend to work better I find at the balance point and these guys tend to work better off the balance point uh, mm, mm, I need another set of arms here it's like this are easier to get moving but they require more effort to control but uh you know I, I still got a pretty light light hand grip you know like i'm uh some people don't like me hinging there i i i, I get there's a lot of people want your this finger engaged a bit more but i, I it seems like it's uh six or one half a dozen of the other angle this up a bit more where it doesn't really seem to matter well it, it no it doesn't it matters but it seems to change from person to person uh, it seems to be very subjective whether you hold it closer to the balance point. This is my weak hand, obviously. I think the stick is heavier. Huh? Engaging my fingers here. It's not the player, it's the sticks. Just because I'm a noob, I'm a noob, don't blame the, don't blame the player. it or not because I can't quite hear it and I, I don't want to play without the hearing aid, uh, hearing, hearing. I want to play with the hearing plugs so I don't have to have hearing aids 
Um, yeah. I'm gonna show you this stick here. Uh, this, uh, just before I wrap up the video here, uh, this came from uh, Martin Doucher. Doucher? Doucher? I don't know if I pronounce Anyway, it's a guy who lives about three towns away, or about a, almost 100 kilometers, about 60 miles for you Americans. He tapes the sticks up like that. That's pretty cool. Now, he broke one stick and he gave me this as a... He's in a band called Jimmy's Dead Band. You can see uh, some of their videos on my channel there. And they, they're a cover band, whatever. But uh, taping your sticks... So, uh, I'm not sure what kind of stick he has here. It's definitely not, it's definitely not a big beast like this. And the guy, the guy plays double bass with two single pedals. Uh... Pretty cool. So yeah, it's probably closer to my. Yeah, it's probably closer to this. I don't know what stick it is, but this seems a little heavier than this. But 